Hey everyone, Trollbender here with Deadfish Flip Flop. Got a new video for you. Had a lot of requests for this one. So those of you lucky enough to own an RTX 4000 series card, here is your DLSS manual update video. First, we want to go to Tech Power Up. I'll put the link in the description below. We want to go to the DLSS 3 frame generation page. This is what it'll look like if you reach the right place. And here are the properties once you have the file so you can verify that you will have the right file. So let's go ahead and download the latest version 1.0.7.0. Pick a mirror, download the file. You'll get the zip file here. It'll appear in downloads or wherever you've specified to download it. Now we want to go ahead and extract this zip file so that you can work with the DLSS file inside of it. So just go ahead and right click on the file, hit extract all and hit extract. It'll put it in the same place that you downloaded the zip file at. Now we have a workable DLSS file. Let's uh, put that aside. Now find where your games are at. Go to this PC where your games are. You may have more than one drive. If not, just C drive. Over on the right, you're going to type in nvngx underscore dlssg dot dll and hit enter. It's going to work on it. Yes. And look, we have one file here. We'll use Cyberpunk 2077 as an example. We're going to right click and hit open file location. And that will bring us directly to the DLSS file we need to update. So we got to back this file up. There's lots of ways to do this. Here's a super simple way. We're going to right click on the file and we're going to want to hit rename or you could just tap on it and in the front of the file just type the word backup. Really easy. If you can't see the .dll at the end this is an easier way to back up your file. So we now have a backed up file the 1.0.50 if you notice that. We want to take that freshly downloaded DLSSG file and we just want to copy that. Right click on it and hit copy if you're in Windows 10 or hit the copy symbol for Windows 11. We are in Windows 11 for this video. And go back to your game folder and simply paste it in. That's it. You're done. You have updated your DLSSG file. We can verify that this is the new file right there, as you can see. And the backup file is the old file. Now, to reverse this, we simply do the reverse. Take the new file that we just did in front of it. Type whatever you want, new, whatever. And then the backup, we just want to remove those words or letters in front of the NVNGX. And that's it. You have reversed this process and we can verify by simply highlighting or, or mousing over. Look, there's the old file, 105. And then the new file we downloaded is somewhere down here. Where the hell did it go? Hello. There it is. Look, see? 1.0.7. Look at that. Q and A. Does every game support DLSS 3? No. DLSS 3 is relatively new, but the list is growing monthly. If you find the DLSSG file when you search, your game supports it. Will updating a game through Steam, Epic, or other platforms affect the DLSS file I've uploaded? It can, yes. The game developers will choose one of three paths for updates. A, the update will overwrite your manual DLSS file with an older file, and you'll have to update again manually. B, the update will keep the DLSS version the same as it currently is. Or C, the update may include a newer DLSS file than what you have. You can always search for the DLSS file after an update and right-click on the file to see the version numbers. What video guards? support DLSS. Well, right now, all NVIDIA RTX cards support DLSS 2. For DLSS 3, you'll need an RTX 4000 series card, the latest hardware from NVIDIA. What happens if I delete my DLSS file? Well, DLSS will not work until you replace that file. More than likely, the option will also not be available in the game, or you may even have some other crazy weird things happen. Well, that's it for Q&A and the DLSSG video. This has been Trollbender for Deadfish Flip Flop. Be sure to hit the subscribe and like buttons. We have a lot more videos to come. Thanks. I love you guys.